Good morning, doll fam. Um, I've got my Pasha Pasha Pulse here because I cannot put her down. Um, yeah, she's been in my possession for a little over 24 hours now, and I just, I, I, I just can't get over her. She's incredible. Um, I don't think I've ever been this in love with a doll before. So, um, I've got found her wig and eyes, got the bodysuit on her, which is awesome. Um, well, I didn't find her a wig, I made her a wig. I had this fiber that I'd recently gotten in um, that I thought might work for her. And as soon as I, I stuck, I tucked a lock into her head cap just to take see how it would look. And it was like, nope, that's it. That's her hairstyle. She's got to have a, a side shave. So then it was like, drop everything and make this now. Because <laughs> as I discussed the other day, once I get it in my head to make something like, um, you know, I've got to, I have to do it immediately. So, um, I try not to, uh, do projects for myself while I owe commissions. You know, people are waiting for things. I always feel bad about doing anything for myself, but the problem is then I never do anything for myself. Um, so, yeah, I, I had actually decided, um, before um, the night before that I was just going to take the day off, which is another thing I hardly ever do. Um, I don't, I don't usually work, you know, like a regular full eight hours or whatever, but, um, I, I pretty much always do at least some work, you know, work for at least a few hours, like, every single day. Um, so I hardly ever just take a day off, and I had decided I was going to do that since I just finished, um, the five heads that I had been working on, um, and I'm, I'm really glad I did, because once I got her out of the box, I couldn't do nothing else. Uh, so, yes, I made her this wig. It is mohair. Um, it is just freaking soft as hell, and oh, I love that color. And those curls, I just, I can't stop playing with her. Um, uh, I've got a short list of names, um, which, I don't know, you can help me out here. You can weigh in, weigh in, uh, what you think. Um, uh, well, the list, let's see, it's, I'm thinking Inga, or Alma. I, I, I'd actually wanted something like Inga or Alma, so those are, those were, those are the leading two that I, like, want to go with. But then I've got two more names that I think are actually the leaders. You know, she's telling me, no, I'm not Angar Alma. I am either Fiona or Magdalena. And I don't know. I, f I feel like Magdalena is kind of winning. And I don't really love that name. But she looks like a Magdalena. I, wa I want her to be Inga, but... She seems to want to be Magdalena, so, I don't know, you tell me, what do you guys think? Inga, Alma, Fiona, Magdalena, that's what I'm, that's the short list. So, um, real quick, because I've had a ton of people asking, um, on size comparisons, um, I'm going to do a full review on her body review. Um, once I get her posing down a little more and, um, you know, just get a little more chance to play with her. But she is fucking brilliantly engineered. The, this posing is just insane. Every single joint is so... Pasha just clearly puts so much into this doll. She's just... Just outstanding. She's... Outstanding. Um, so anyway, size-wise... Um, Here's a, here's my Lemwa SD, well, sideways maybe, <laughs> it doesn't really fit in frame. Here's my Lemwa SD, no, that doesn't really work, okay. Uh, um, well here they're both standing on my legs, so you can see, well, I guess I could give her a head. Let's give her a head, that might be more helpful, we'll just set it on there, call that good. Alright, there's Limois. 
who is like 57 centimeters and Pasha Pasha you can see she looks very tiny next to her they're both standing on my leg um, the Pasha Pasha is like 50 I don't know maybe like 52 centimeters or something I think about and she's also standing on her very tippiest toes um, so that even gives her a little extra height so she looks very small next to um, a, this is like a standard SD she's kind of on the smaller side for SDs um, and yes very tiny next to her they definitely can't wear clothes I tried a bunch of clothes on her today I mean share clothes I tried a bunch of things on her today and um, even like my smallest SD stuff was just super baggy on her. Looks pretty ridiculous. So here is what I found. Oh, she's floppy. This is my mini ingenue um, from Twiggling Artifacts Kindred. Uh, and well, okay, here's they're standing on my leg again. So you can see um, Pasha is much taller than the mini ingenue. Actually, if we line their heels up. So she's much taller than her, but their their torsos are a fairly similar size. Maybe you could, oh, okay, she's floppy. She needs to be um, suede at the least. You can see like their hips and butts are fairly similar. Their thighs fairly similar. Um, obviously, Pasha's shoulders are a lot wider. Of course, I think um, Anjanu's shoulders are kind of narrow, but she is an MSD. She's like 44 centimeters, um, and yeah, their torsos are fairly similar, actually, um, and then their head sizes are too. So if you were looking for another doll to go with your with a Pasha Pasha. Um, a, a taller MSD is probably going to be your best bet because I think she she kind of she technically falls under the SD range, but she's she really doesn't compare to the SDs at all. So yeah, yes, yeah, yes. Um, oh, so I did I did find a few MSD things that fit her, um, like for standard MSD, not um, not. Not slim MSD, but uh, a couple of... And I, I don't really have much standard MSD in my collection. All of my MSD dolls are and were um, slim MSDs. So I don't have much to try on there. But I did find a couple of pieces that I had um, that did indeed fit her. Um, you know, maybe not exactly as intended because of a different, like, slightly longer torso. Um... But they did fit, so if you were going to try to find something that fit her, that would be your best starting point, is a larger MSD. Alright. <sighs> so, once again, that was just supposed to be the intro. Not the intro, but, you know, here's a quick bang before I actually start my video. But, um, yes, once again, I'm already at almost nine minutes, so... Maybe I'll just leave that there again, and, um, yeah, I didn't even start my work, so we'll see. Maybe I'll do another one. Maybe I'll save my chatter for tomorrow night. But, um, yeah. Stop it. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Have a good day.